Hello everyone and welcome to another IA Roadkill Gaming video. We are playing Farming Simulator 19 and we are in New Woodshire with normal economy and trying to achieve 10 million in bank. We are playing on the PlayStation 4 and this is episode 47. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons please. Thank you. We are coming up on the end of the corn harvest. I have... Well, this is the last field that we have corn in. I do want to go back and hit the ends of each row because I think he has been missing. Whoops, and I have been missing because I was looking elsewhere. I think he missed a stalk or two here and there. Nobody's going to get rich on it, but I just, you know, I can't sleep at night thinking I left something out in the field. So. I did not have to purchase a different trailer, wagon, tipper, whatever. Uh, it, this one worked just fine. And I also realized that I could have, I'm just checking the ends here, I could have dumped the soybeans that I'm storing in the tipper that I have in the shed, I could have dumped that in the railroad silo. So, yeah, I could still do that. Okay. We have 2131 corn in the bottom right corner. And if you watch the tail end of my harvester, you will see... Oh, there's a piece. Wasn't enough to give us another liter yet. But we found one stalk of corn. Come on. Don't fail me. Give me some more. Really? Come on. And you know, I told you I wasn't going to buy any more fields. Oh, that field dead ahead looks really, really good to me. It's got soybeans in it. No weeds. It is... It's only half fertilized, but... Oh, I may be buying that one. I don't know. All right, we're still on 2131. Looking for another liter of corn to make this worthwhile. <gasps> there it is, 2132. I missed it when it was getting grabbed by the the front end you can I can normally see the tuft of smoke pop up ooh just about clip the front of my tractor so I have been dumping all of the corn in with the pigs so they are getting pretty full. But I figured, eh, might as well fill them up. I'm not going to get $10 million worth of harvest this harvest round. So I will fill up the pigs and then we won't have to worry about them for a while. Now we can sell everything. I harvested that field. That had corn in it. I'm thinking about buying this one also. I don't know. Another field of canola. And there's a huge field of oats. Um, 28. 
in the up on the hill. I think it's twenty eight. But I might as well have them, because I really am not interested in doing any contracts anymore. I'm worried about just doing my own fields. So I'm thinking about buying, buying up the rest of the really nice, flat, easy to work with fields. And my old red is coming along nicely. I haven't been over here lately to look at him, but yeah, he's almost done with the canola field. I touched up some of the pieces, but I might have another spot or two I need to touch up. All right, I am going to leave this right here. to remind me to clean it. And I'm gonna come grab the header for everything else but corn. Come on. And we might as well start the oats. And I'm not going to start it on this end. I'm going to go down to the other end. Ah, I might as well do a headland. Any cars coming? Oh, man. Don't do that. Oh, no, 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 no. All right. Let's see here. Oh, i got to go down here so he can get by me. I wasn't thinking. I should have done a headland. Well, I might as well do two headlands. If I gotta drive all the way back, I might as well do two headlands. Oh, and while I'm thinking of it, I need to make sure we have straw swath enabled. Yes, we do. And, yeah, we'll just leave it right there. Let's turn this off before we get started. There we go. And we'll set a worker on it right off the bat. We are harvesting oats, and we are giving a straw swath. Nice. And we are stopping traffic. That is also nice. I thought about getting a bigger harvester, but I don't know if I want to spend the money. I mean, yeah, this guy takes me a little longer to harvest. And maybe, well, actually this field is smaller than the canola field was. But if I'm going to multitask, which I'm going to do on this field as well, I'll be bailing while I'm letting a worker do the harvesting. It doesn't need to be a monster harvester. We're still three million in the hole. Ten million is still a very long way off. Well, 
Oh, you're not gonna make it to the end, are you? Oh, you're trying. Nope, you didn't. I will help you. There you go. Dump the straw right there. And I'm not going to be able to get backed in there. Well, alright. Let's take a headland on this side, too. We'll just... Oh, you're going to mess up everywhere, aren't you? This is where the uh, little lot of trees was, and it is it is a problem, child. I'm sure I have a stump in there somewhere, but I don't have the treks in this series, so we're just putting up with it. And there's another bad spot over there where the road used to be in between the two fields. You can see a dark spot. That has a stump or two in it. It is almost, well, 1800. What is that? Six o'clock. don't have I don't believe I have anything in the BGA right now yes I do I've got a few bales that did not drop but I don't think I added anything else somebody has completed their task oh uh he was doing the canola field. All right, let's pay attention to what we're doing here. Going to get to the end? No, come on. It's just another foot. Maybe two. All right, this one I've got enough room to turn around. Kind of. There we go. And we're off. I don't want to dilly-dally because I want all the straw to be on the field, not the grass. But there's a little in the grass anyway. Of course there is. Yeah. So, we need to bale up the grass. It's bouncing me on that straw pile. Or, yeah, I called it grass. Straw pile. I don't want to see any grass for a while. We are not going to make it back to our starting corner before we are full. I am going to have to park this and run grab the tractor with the wagon. I would jump out right now, but I know he's going to mess up down at the end here. You can see where it's lighter color. That's where the little plot of land was that we cleared and leveled. Hmm. I think I need to go back to the barn and do a little repair. We are only going five miles an hour. That is just a little unacceptable. Is he gonna make it all the way? No, he's already thinking about stopping. 
Oh, he did make it all the way. All right, now I'll put another headland this way so that he's got room to turn around before the road. Because we're going to send him long, yeah, long ways down the field. Okay, well, I'm going to let him go until he stops, and I'm going to go run grab the tractor. I will be back to you in just a shake of a tail. And we are back, giving the pigs the last of the corn. Always go the wrong way. Oh, they did not take it all. 1,000 liters left. Well, and it won't let me pile it on the ground there. How big a pile will a thousand liters be? Oh, I'll just be safe and put it in here. I really didn't think we were going to fill the pigs all the way up. Those guys are hungry. We made it clear to the end here, and he was getting ready to start another row. And I had to jump in quick and stop him. Speaking about stopping things. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want to do this in the field because it will spit out straw. And I don't want to spit out straw on the road. Is there a car there? It's going to turn around, but... Oats. We have oats. We have oats and we have straw. Turn the lights off. Don't need to see that flashing. And now we can set him off going this direction. Oh, now hitbox on that is bigger than the vehicle is. Here we go. Okie dokie. And we got a tuft of straw right there. Boy, these all these people have been to a movie or something that all got out at the same time. see customize we want to give him 
back his wide tires. Does he need weights? What? He's never had wide tires? Oh, he had on the Midas because Midas standards are wide. Yeah, that's what he had. That looks good. All right, we want we want a super pooper. So that answers that question. I can't sell this. I still need to make straw bales. Although, I should be making round straw bales. A few. Is this the movie crew back again? Well, we'll just button line here. And we've got just a little itty bitty bit of grass in there. First we need to unfold. Let's see, that's this. And then we need to do that. And then we do that. <clears throat> so the first bale we're gonna get is gonna be grass. Didn't realize we still had grass in here. And we're going to need to come pick these up before the harvester gets down here, or he will end up hitting them and getting stuck. to empty it right here and then we are going to go to the other end and start that way there are no bales right down here hopefully we can get down here and turn around before he shows up there we go out of his way And we won't have to worry about him hitting bales for a while. Whoops, I need to do a couple headlands down here. <clears throat> so we will dismiss him. And then we can do that before we hire him back up again. And we need to move this tractor. When we're done filling. Uh, 
out of the way. You know, we haven't heard from uh, Old Red lately. <clears throat> Excuse me. He's supposed to be cultivating the canola field. I wonder what he's up to. Alright, we'll put a worker on this. Just because I can't draw a, draw a straight line. <laughs> straw a straight line. That's what I was going to say. So if you haven't caught my episodes before, uh, you need to check out my UFO episode. Because it's still hovering in this field over here. And you see it in the left corner, just underneath the yellow tractor? See that little dot? I'm trying to keep it in that corner. It's right underneath the tractor, right over the tractor, right there. See it moving? Anyway, that's one of them. And there's another one, like right there somewhere. Anyway, check that out. This map has ghosts, or UFO as I called them. I'm going to be trapped in here. How am I going to get turned around? That was poor planning. Well, at least he went to the end on that one. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's just back up. Oh, that'll take too long. Let's just turn left. And we'll just turn left again. I don't think I'm going to get it all. Yeah, I could. Alright, we'll back up here. There we go. We getting it all? Barely. My goodness. And now we will put him back to work. I hope one headland here is enough. Just about drove on my oats. There we go. Is he going to do it? Yep. Okay, let's run back down and grab our baler. And, actually, I'm going to go check on... Sorry. I'm going to go check on old Red. See where he is at. Looks like he's got some spots there he missed. I'm going to have to go back and get. And, looks like one right here. And he is not done. I hope he's not stuck somewhere and milking the paycheck. Oh, 
Oh my goodness, we've still got canola down here. Well, I dare say maybe he's smarter than I think. He didn't finish because he knew there was canola here. Well, all right, we'll just leave him there. We'll have to come back here and get that canola when we get done with the oat harvest. Might as well grab the trailer while I'm at it, or while I'm over here. Probably should have come over here with the wrapper and gotten rid of that grass bale first. Just doing everything out of order, aren't I? Oh, there it is. I was headed down here to this small shed. Ooh, I almost hit the eggs. We would have had omelets. What the heck is wrong with that? Why was it flying all over? Huh. All right, now I can pick up straw bales. And I gotta figure out how to turn it on. There we go. Not quite a full trailer. Too short, darn it. Well, we got those picked up and out of the way anyway. All right. 
well, I am going to make more bales and harvest. And then I will be back with you when we get a little farther along. Well, I was hoping to get done with this field before it got dark, but it does not look like I am going to make it. I'm obviously bailing while a worker is harvesting the field. And I took one stack of bales up on the hill already and then I decided well I don't need to run them up there right now I just need to get everything done so I put one stack over there and I decided I don't need to be picking them up yet because I haven't caught up to the harvester yet so I'm gonna wait until I get caught up to the harvester and then I will run around and pick some up and stack them over there But it is a good sized field. I could not imagine doing this with that round baler that I did have. Because you have to stop and back up. Every one of these bales I would have had to stop, back up, let it unload, and then go forward again. Where the square auto baler, I'll call it, you just drive. It's a little bit of a hassle if you wanted to wrap bales, but if you're doing straw, this is the only way to do it. Or use a uh, loading wagon. There we go, another row done. Almost caught up to him. Every time I think I'm going to get caught up to him, he starts a new row. And I won't be able to pick up the bales at night because I won't be able to see them. They are hard to see at night. Silage bales you can see at night pretty well because they reflect light. But I have not had a good chance, a good track record of picking up straw bales at night. But we're gonna try and get as much done before dark as we can. I was just thinking what I might do is bale every other row and then everything would be in a straight line I could run around and pick those up and then bale the lines that I left and everything should be laying in a row So I might, I might think about doing that. Come on, there we go. That way I could get everything stacked up over here and then I wouldn't miss anything in case there is an awesome price for straw tonight after I get done harvesting. Now I could just drive down between the two rows and get them, but it's not that... Whoops, we're not on. There we go. But that's not that uh, reliable, I'll say. Although I'm not going to miss one of them now. 
but at night you would never know whether you missed it or not. You'd know in the morning. And speaking of in the morning, I'm thinking about fertilizing this property, this field, with the uh, all the stuff that's over there in the biogas plant. Digestate, that's it. And oh, that bugs me when it automatically pops over like that. I wish there was a way to reset it so it automatically went back to the center of your trailer and it wouldn't dump. I mean, it wouldn't kick it out to the side like that. Oh, darn it. I hit it too soon. And I don't want to get out of the other bundle. And my worker's done. And I gotta get over there. There. Um, if it's gonna do that, I've gotta bring it around this way and then I can stack them together. Like that. Come on, there we go. All right, now I won't, I won't hit it to reload till I get resituated. But I got to get over here and get my wagon. Oops, I left the other tractor running too, didn't I? And he's got the pipe on the wrong side, of course. And I'll just leave that sit right there. So, dismiss. Turn off that beacon. Yeah, it's getting too dark. Okie doke. Get the worker back at it so I can pick up more bales. Is that where he was? Pretty close. Can get that edge good. Yep. All right. And that's just fine right there. And where did I leave my other tractor? Where did I leave my other tractor? Oh, it's back here. Because that's where my wagon was. All right. Well, I'm going to run around and pick up the rest of these bales. And it is still running. I'm going to pick up the rest of the bales and then pick up every other row or bale every other row and see how that goes. And I know it's going to be dark, but I will be back with you when I get to that point. So before it gets too dark, I thought I'd pop back on and show you what I'm talking about. I'm going to bale this line of straw and then I'm gonna skip the next one and it's the way I normally bale straw anyway or any whenever I bale I go down this row I skip that one because it's just too tight of a corner and I'll come over to this one but before I loop back and get the all the lines that I miss, I'm going to bring the wagon down here, the bale wagon, 
and pick up all these bales because I'll be able to see these lines like a runway to keep me in a straight line to pick pick everything up and not miss anything. I don't know if that made any sense or not. Boy, it's bumpy right here. I bet you can't guess what I did. I forgot all about the harvester being low on fuel. I never used to do that, and now I've been doing it every time. Evidently, I'm not close enough. that work? We uh, ran out of fuel at 100% full capacity of oats. Okay, now the trailer for fuel is empty. And I did it again. did it again. Recorded a bunch and didn't have my volume on. Well, I finished the harvesting and started baling and not too long I ran into this. Now, I'm not ready to sell yet because the price isn't there, but I waited around. And finally the price leveled off so that I could sell. I could have sold at any time, but I was waiting until it hit as high as it could. But we're going to sell off all the straw, except for some I'm going to keep back for the pigs. But we're going to call that the end of an episode. I would like to thank everyone who stayed to watch the entire video. If you found it enjoyable, I would appreciate it if you would hit that like button. If you would like to see more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you want to leave a comment, you may do so below. With that said, I would like to wish everyone, including you, a very wonderful day. Goodbye for now.